All right, so we're going to do an unboxing and a product review today. So this is the camera. This is the box that it comes in. Um, I ordered two, so I've already opened one of these boxes. And what I like about this is that it all comes in one box. So here's the actual unit. And it's wrapped in this protective little plastic, but it's still easy to open. All right, and then this is how it comes. So you'll want to take off the little protective screen that covers the camera. And next you'll want to open up the little box that has the charging cord and the plug. So in this, you have a little disc. Um, I think that this helps weigh it down a little bit. And then you have this little adhesive sticker. So you can set those aside. You won't actually need those until you go to install it wherever you want to put it. And then this is the cord that it comes with. Now it um, does have USB capabilities as well as this outlet. So for setup, because I have my laptop here, I'm just going to plug it in to the USB. All right. <clears throat> the instructions for setup are actually really, really simple. Um, I'm not tech savvy, but I was able to follow these directions pretty quickly. Um, so for setup, it says download the app and create an account. That's actually really, really simple. You um, submit your email address, put in a password, and then you will be prompted to put in the code that they email you. Um, and then connect the camera to a power outlet and wait 20 seconds until the yellow light starts to flash. So I've already got the USB plugged into my computer. And then here's where you wanna plug in the other end of that. And you can see that the yellow light is on and then it's gonna start flashing when it's ready for setup. All right, and there you go. Um, now you want to press the setup button for three seconds until you hear a voice prompt. So the setup button is actually underneath the little base. So here's how it comes. You just want to gently tug on it until it comes out, and then the setup button right here. You don't need a pen or a pin. You can actually do it with your finger. One critique of this already is that if you don't have this pushed in all the way, um, it is really difficult to get it in there. Um, and then press this button. Ready to connect. And then the directions that come with it actually say to finish um, setup in the in the app. So I'm gonna 